Mr. President, uh, thank you for that explanation. But I do not understand the response that this bill was prepared during, before the pandemic. So what does that mean? What does that mean? What, what's, what is the, what is the effect Ay, ang ibig, ang ibig, ah, sorry, sorry, Mr. President. Ang ibig sabihin, Mr. President, ito, hindi ito po ito na tinayming sa, sa pandemia. Kumbaga po, existing na itong uh, bill na ito, approved na po ito, bago pa po nagpandemia. Yun po ang pinaka-point uh, doon sa, sa statement ko po, sa answer ko. Thank yes, you. Mr. President, but we are living in the now, and we must, we must be responsible and responsive to what our situation is now. So, in the in the bill that we passed, the create bill that we passed, yung inabot ng pandemic, nauna, before the pandemic, that was sitira. And the reduction of the corporate income tax was 1% per year. But because of the pandemic, we changed the bill. We changed the bill because we needed an immediate response to help the people and to help businesses. So we immediately decreased the income tax, the corporate income tax by 5% instead of 1% per year. So it is our duty as lawmakers to be the one to adjust. If, if we will make the, the give a reason, give the reason that eh, dati pa to, wala pang pandemic noon, then we are not being responsive to, to the needs of our people. If there is a if there is a natural calamity. We pull out funding and we put it we put it uh, in in that area that needs that needs assistance for the calamity natural ho yon so the, thing, the reason i bring this up is because the timing to support to put to support the the creation of offices of offices ah hindi to hindi to pondo the, the funding that his owner is asking for is not will not even go directly to the athletes this is for the creation of offices and when i say his owner does not answer the question i do not understand why there has to be a new office when gab has regional offices and hindi po niyo na, na, na ipaliwanag kung ano yung hindi nagagawa ng gab Na dapat nilang gawin. Now, if it is not in their mandate, then why not amend it? That is the easiest thing to do to save money. That is what I'm saying. Is this okay. amenable to that? Let us amend it. Let us do their job. Bantayan nyo unang isang taon, dalawang taon kung hindi nila nagawa. Mauna akong mag-support sa inyo. Kasi syempre gusto ko nahalagaan yung athletes natin. Mr. President, so, may I, uh, I uh, interrupt? Uh, sorry, Mr. President. Mm -hmm. interrupt. Mr. President, we can open close, uh, we can we can open the, the, the budget requirements for this bill, Mr. President. Pwedeng bigyan ng 500,000, 200,000. I'm sure siguro, pwede, naman, pwede na siguro yan. Kung, eh, kung yan ang uh, 1 million, okay lang, 2 million, wala pong problema dyan. Et, 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 wala po akong problema dyan. As long as may establish itong, itong uh, Philippine boxing, no problem with the, the concern. The main concern of the good lady from the gig is the budget. I, I, have, I have no question with that. Pwedeng 200,000, pwedeng 500,000. I'm sure, uh, siguro, uh, may intindihan na po yan ng ating uh, mahal na uh, kasama uh, from Tagig. Uh, Oka po pwede mag-submit ang ating uh, sponsor ng um, budget proposal for this kasi kung 200,000 lang yan, no. I'm sure his, between myself and his owner, pwede na tayo mag-donate para private fund na lang itong boxing. I will come up with the 100, sa inyo na yung 100. Huwag na natin gawing public kasi like I said, these are boxing commissions are private in many countries because I do not know how you will come up with your offices of Luzon, Visayas, yeah. Mindanao, which you put on record with 200,000. So baka ipasa natin yan tapos sabihin ng mga tao o oh, nasa na yung ano, nasa na yung pinangako nyo na may mga opisina.